Hey all, this is Mr. Hammond. In this video, we are looking at a Chrome extension called CRX Mouse Chrome Gestures. So this is an accessibility tool that makes navigation in the Chrome web browser just a little bit easier using a physical mouse. So not necessarily the mouse pad that is on your Chromebook. There are some features that you can use the one, two, three, and even four finger swipes that make navigation just a little bit easier on the Chromebooks. This is very similar to that only with a physical mouse. So let's take a look at what this tool can do. So I already have this downloaded and installed in my extension. So you can see it up here. There's this gray and purple arrow. If I click on that, you can see a lot of the gestures that are there. If I look at the active gestures, I have the back, the forward, the scroll up, scroll down, and there are a lot more uh, technical gestures that are there as well. So how these work is if I want to, let's say, go back a page, I would simply hold down the right button on my mouse and just slide backwards. And you can see that purple line that indicates that this extension is working. So it took me to the page that I had been on previously. Now, if I want to go forward a page, I can do the same exact thing, just the other direction. So if you pay attention to the middle of the screen, it does show me exactly what this mouse gesture is going to do as soon as I let go of the mouse. So I can see it's going to take me back. So if I let go of that, it takes me back to the previous page. Now, there are some other mouse gestures. If I want to scroll down the page, I can do that with just the mouse and let's say if I don't have the scrolling wheel notice that scrolls down and if I right click and go up it scrolls up now there's are some others uh, for example I believe this one reloads the page so you just kind of go up and uh, slant down diagonally and you can do it from both directions but you can see all of the gestures that are active, at least right from here. Now, if you want to see every single gesture, you can click on that icon and hit the settings button. And from here, you can see all of the mouse gestures. So hit that second mouse gestures option. And if you scroll down the page, you can see all of the gestures that are there. And you can even edit them if you wish. And if you'd like, you can even add your own gestures there and some other of the settings. So that from the general settings, I'm just going to point out a couple of these. One of them is the mouse cursor. So you can always change your mouse cursor from here. And then if you want to return to the default cursor, just make sure you hit that and then reload the page. You can also, if there are particular sites that you don't want this to work on, for one reason or another, you can add those websites here. And you would just add them one line at a time. There are some other settings and options available. However, I really think this could be useful just for the simple fact of being able to do some of these simpler uh, gestures. And then over time, you might learn some of the other gestures as well, which could make moving about Chrome just a little bit easier for you. So hopefully that is something you found helpful. If you have any questions on this or anything else, please let me know. Thanks.